The Donegal Weaving Traineeship is the first accredited weaving course available in Ireland and it's currently been delivered in Kilcarra in South Donegal, an area that has a very strong history and tradition of weaving. It's a full-time course and it's been developed by Donegal ETB's Further Education and Training Service and it's accredited by the Scottish Qualifications Authority. I suppose the aim of the course is twofold. One, we wanted to support the preservation of a very important Indigenous craft, uh, which is uh, known worldwide. And secondly, we wanted to provide employment opportunities. And we're hoping that the course will be of use to uh, companies because they are currently experiencing a shortage of skilled weavers. This course fits very well with uh, the values of Donegal ETB because we are about community and inclusion and about excellence in the delivery of education and training opportunities for the people of Donegal. We're very grateful to the individuals and the companies who helped us with the development of this course. And they include uh, McGee Clothing, uh, McNutts of Donegal, Malloy's and Sons, uh, Studio Donegal and the Harris Tweed Authority in Scotland. And also the individuals, uh, Peter Sweeney, who helped us with scoping the course. And then of course the tutors, uh, John Hina and Valerie Taylor. We're delighted to have uh, local students participating and in some cases from third and fourth generation families of weavers and also other people who've come from across the country to participate in this course. Es grüß ihn das Beschielte, a tes a chur se fiederachte, agus te magita brodu las, agus asna ran farchiha, a vekish of a revishan, agus asna obergalante, a te janu wakou. Kohar jasla, a hamanya. I'm on this course now and I'm loving it really because I've always had an interest in weaving um, since I was a teenager really and I don't really know why but I just started making looms to make clothes on because I just love the idea of weaving stuff you can wear. I'd love to be making clothes for people but it was never really a feasible thing until I got onto this course where I'm learning to weave with a fly shuttle loom and the fly shuttle makes it so much faster to weave lengths of fabric and you can weave really finer yarns which just is so much easier to sew if you're trying to make something from it. I've always kind of worn stuff I've made myself and people would notice it because there's a certain quality to handmade stuff that, that just kind of stands out and even though my attempts would be kind of shabby enough. They're getting better and I just love to get really good at it and make really decent garments. And people, if they want to say make a hoodie for me, I'd like to be able to say, yeah, no problem. <laughs> I've always been interested in weaving. My father was a weaver. He was born in Glen Kill, 1920, and he spent most of his life weaving both myself and my brother used to ask him to teach us but he wasn't really interested in teaching us because I think he associated the weaving with poverty and hardship. Um, like He was weaving from the age of 12, he was the eldest of 12 and uh, it wasn't a career choice as such, it was something that was born out of necessity. So uh, when I saw this course advertised I just couldn't believe it, it was just exactly what I was interested in doing. I've uh, worked as a teacher most of my life, and um, but I was always interested in weaving. It's just been very interesting researching the whole history of Donegal, Tweed, and how my dad's story fitted into all of that. I suppose I have always been interested in handcrafts, in knitting, in crochet, in lace making, anything to do with, with handcrafts and wool have always sort of lit my fire as it were. They're crafts that are dying that have been such a intricate part of our um, nationality I suppose and there's lots of opportunities there to, to pick up the machinery and just to, to get at it and to enjoy it. And it's also very environmentally friendly. It's all very green, it's recyclable clothing, it's ethically made, there's no air miles in doing it, you know, what's not to like? 
I've always had an interest in textiles. I've always been knitting, I've done spinning, and more recently a lot of patchwork. I have attended workshops uh, throughout the years and then I found this course here in Kilcar. So it's really a fantastic course and it's such an opportunity to keep the craft of weaving alive. My grandfather was, was a weaver and uh, I had two uncles that was weavers as well. My grandfather actually passed away um, in October 2020 and I got his limb when, when he died. I got the limb probably last April and uh, about a month or two later I heard that the course was starting in here in Kilkyar and I was delighted like when I heard it because it was, it was something I wanted to learn for quite a long time, you know. 